Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I got an interview experience of one of the candidates who has placed in Cognizant. And in today's video, I'm gonna share all the interview rounds, all the interview questions in detail. So if you are going to join Cognizant in a future, this video is going to be really helpful for you. So let's start the video without any further delay. Before starting, if you are new to my channel, consider subscribing my channel because that is really important. So basically the interview process of Cognizant consists of three rounds. First is online test, second is technical round and the third one is HR round. So let's see the first round which is online test. The duration of online test depends upon their requirement. It starts from 30 minutes and it can go up to two hours. Over there the syllabus is of normal pattern like aptitude, reasoning and verbal. Apart from that, if this uh, test round will last for one and a half hour or two hour, then they will ask some question related to your programming language, related to OOPS concept, related to pseudo codes like that. And if it is of 30 minutes, then they will ask only after two reasoning and verbal. So this is about the online test. Let's see the second round, which is technical round. In technical round, they will definitely going to start with your introduction, with your projects like that. You have to explain the project and then there will be some cross question on the projects. Apart from that, they will deep dive into the basics of computer science and mostly the important subjects of computer science like computer networks, DBMS, OOPS, like that. So they are going to ask question based on this and you have to answer that. Operating systems is also there. Your core subject should be kind of strong to answer those questions. Apart from this, they are going to move on into the programming language based on your preference. If your preference is Java, they are going to ask some question based on Java, features of Java, oops concepts of Java, and some of the hidden concept of Java, they're going to ask like that. Then they will move into the coding part, where first they will assign you some of the questions, and you have to tell the logic of that question with the time complexities and all. If you can satisfy the interviewer, they will not going to tell you that you have to write the code of this. And if you can't able to satisfy, then you have to write the code. They will tell share your screen and write the code. Like, let's deep dive into HR round. So HR round is really important round for you guys. In HR round, basically HR round will going to decide your selection or rejection. In HR round, they are going to check whether you are really interested into the cognizant or not. If you are interested, then they will going to check whether you will align with the company's requirement or not, whether you will be suitable for the project team or not, like that. So basically they are going to start with your family background. Then they are going to check your interest. Then they are going to check your educational background. Then they are going to check about your projects and all. Over here also you have to explain some of the projects. Then they are going to check whether you have knowledge about some trending topics or not, like AI, ML, machine learning, data science and all. And then they are going to ask some behavioral question based on some scenarios. And yeah, that is all about the HR round. So yeah, that's all for this video guys. If this video is really important for you, please like and share this video and also subscribe to my channel if you are new to my channel. So yeah, I'm wrapping this video over here, signing off.